Let's start off with a look at your winter weather advisory. This is the area shaded in white, mainly Jackson Hole area, Star Valley area. We're looking at some snow starting up here pretty soon. Two to five inches of new snow with those winds anywhere from 20 to 30, 40 mile per hour gusts. So that's going to create some hazardous driving conditions. Uh, in fact, we do have a lot of snow already on Wyoming 22 as you head into Wilson. Here's a look at the Teton Pass. Chains are advised if you're headed over any of the passes in through eastern Idaho, especially into Wyoming. Right now, 21 degrees with mostly cloudy skies with winds at 16 miles per hour. That takes you down to a seven for feels like temperature in through Idaho Falls, mostly cloudy conditions as well. 23 degrees, 16 mile per hour wind speeds. 10 is your feels like temperature starting off on this Monday morning. Some of the regional temperatures right now, we're looking at 22 for Dubois, single digits for Island Park, 19 for Driggs, Jackson 20, Afton 21, Montpelier 22, Malad City at 24 to start off on this President's Day Monday. Wind speeds in through the Snake River Plain, double digit wind speeds, 11 mile per hour winds through Aberdeen, 10 mile per hour winds out at the site, a little bit lighter winds in through Mud Lake starting off today. But you factor those winds in, look at these uh, feels like temperature wind chill trackers, six for Driggs, 6 for Jackson, 13 for Afton. Pocatello takes you down to a 7. Burley takes you down to a 12. Haley, 5 degrees above. Now you can see that light snow that's pushed through eastern Idaho, now pushing into the eastern highlands, up into uh, Wyoming. That's hitting Jackson here in the next couple of hours, getting some snow your way. Behind that, we're looking at some pretty uh, settling conditions as far as the snow goes. So we're pretty much done with the snow, but we're going to have some colder air move into the region. In fact, today, mostly cloudy skies are daytime highs. Not much want more warmer than what we have right now. 26 for a high in Idaho Falls and Rexburg, 28 Blackfoot, 32 Pocatello. So we enjoyed some comfortable temperatures over the weekend. Not so much this week. Cloudy skies through the highlands in western Wyoming with some snow in the early morning hours. Jackson, 25. Afton, 21. Island Park, 19. And then mostly cloudy conditions through the central mountains. Looking for a high of 27 for Chalice, 28 for Salmon, 21 for Ledor, 24 for Arco. Moving into the overnight hours, Tuesday morning, these lows dropping below zero through Salmon, Ledor, Stanley. Single digit lows in through Arco, Mackey, and Chalice with cloudy conditions. More clouds in through the highlands in western Wyoming. Below zero temperature temperatures for Yellowstone and Island Park, five above for a low tonight in Jackson, Afton three, Driggs seven, Soda Springs five, and even in through the valley, we're looking for mostly cloudy skies and cold temperatures, single digit temperature lows for Idaho Falls, Rexburg and American Falls, 16 for a low tonight in through Pocatello. Now as we take a look at your Southeast Idaho Chevy dealer's seven day forecast, cold is the word for the next few days with highs only in the 20s, lows below zero to the single digits. In fact, we might not get above freezing until next Saturday. Blackfoot also with the cloudy skies, chance of snow on Thursday, teens for the high tomorrow, 20s for the remainder of the week, single digit lows for the rest of the week for those overnight lows. Idaho Falls cloudy and cold tomorrow, 16 the high, two below the low Tuesday into Wednesday. Wednesday. Teens for Wednesday and Thursday, 20s for Friday and Saturday. In through Rexburg, look for some clouds tomorrow. Chance of some snow in the early morning hours. Some sunshine for Wednesday. Highs in the teens and 20s. Lows in the single digits to below zero. Through the Teton area, looking for some uh, chance of snow in the early morning hours tomorrow. Partly cloudy through Wednesday. Cloudy for Thursday. Cold temperatures. Teens and 20s for the highs and those overnight lows below zero. And in through the Central Mountains, mostly cloudy. 16 the high tomorrow. 20s for the rest of the week and those overnight lows from the single digits to below zero. Deanne?